Hello and welcome to our channel. My name is Shantanu Shivastav and today I'm going to show you how can we create nesting grids. As we can see, there are records of games and we have some related records of from game the student's name and uh, what we can do, we can see all the students, the subgrid value from here. So this is called nesting grid and how can we create it? We are going to show in this video and just like as you can see that options are also coming in the colors. Uh, game type is an option set field and trial result is also option set field and as you can see that they are coming in colors how can we configure this we are going to see in this video we are going to see that how can we go from this to this for that let's start configuring this is our uh, model driven app and here is you can see that the game and table and in the game table if i open any record so here you can see there are this child table also associated with it which is of students uh, who are inter interested in these games so right now from here we cannot see which are the child record all the uh, child records that these records have for it we have to have to open any record and we can then go down to check in the grid so what we want we want that grid to be seen here that's why we are going to use power grid here so for that uh, open your solution in power apps So this is the solution where I have this. So right now what we use, we have to use, we have to use the classic customization. So here, this is the old name of tables, which is entities. So open, uh, first of all, we have to open the parent entity, which is in this case is games. Open it and go to control. Click on add control, uh, search for the power uh, grid. This one, click on add now uh, come down here so what we have to do we have to add entity which is the child entity to this in this case it's student and view we can select so right now we have active view only click ok then come here child item parent id so here what we need to do we need to uh, add uh, the lookup field name of and record from the child form so here we have this uh, gaming interest lookup which is in the student form and click ok and what more thing what we can do we could add some color in our option also from here enable option set color we could select this one also uh, it will always look nice click ok now save it and then publish it so now it's been published what one more thing that can we do we could add color in our option set so let's open our student table click on forms main form here we are going to add a new column name as trial result and uh, data type should be choice and uh, here we could select uh, uh, that label color so let's suppose first is uh, trial result should be selected so for selected i'm going to select this color And the second one should be in process. For that, uh, uh, we should select a color which is more likely to yellowish. Always uh, use pastel color, it looks nice. And third would be not selected. For that, I'm going to select a red one. And then name would be trial result and click on save. Now we sync this choice with our uh, choice that we have created, which is called trial result. And now click on save. I'm going to edit here now click on save and publish we are going to add it on view also the same column here click on save and publish now go back here to the control 
we have to add this also here enable it for the web phone and tablet enable option color is also yes now click on save click on publish once it published we'll go back and do a hard refresh here and we could see the difference in the option here here we could see the difference here and uh, now we have power grid control also and if you want to just click here we could see uh, the child grids here from uh, this view we don't have to go inside any record to see the child records and if i open it and let's suppose uh, selected click on save and close so as you can see the trial result also coming green so i have selected different option for different records and as you can see that for abay it's in progress and upshake is not selected so that's it from our video if you like it please like and subscribe and share do comments if you have any doubts thank you